Yo, what's the word? It's your boy Zente, and I'm back like I never left. Today's video is stand-up comedy Corey Holcomb. If this is your first time here and you want to be part of the clock gang, make sure you smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications. But let's get right into this video. Alright, this next cat has no problem speaking his mind. This boy is wild right here. Y'all show some love for Corey, <laughs> Hitman, Holcomb, let him in. Yeah. All right, what up with it? Okay, here we go. Um, <laughs> fellas, uh, clap your hands if you here with a girl you're going to break up with when you get on your feet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she is one job interview away from finding out how you really feel. <laughs> <laughs> Me, hey. Ladies, do men cheat more? Men, we, we cheat more? I think so. We can admit that. But let me tell you something, ladies. This is what y'all are doing. No, we don't. We just get caught more. And it's out there more. Women are very sneaky, so don't let them fool you. It's really scandalous. Y'all always admit that. But let me tell you something, ladies. This is what y'all are doing. It's really scandalous. Y'all always mess around with somebody you really like. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. You know, like you trying to upgrade. <laughs> I would never do you like that, you know? <laughs> I can't stand the people I mess around with. Facts. I got busted the other day. I walking out this restaurant with this girl, and my girl showed up. It was just like on that show, Cheaters, you know? I was, oh, hey, baby, what's up? <laughs> Looked like I was swallowing peanut butter. <laughs> My girl ain't make it no easier. She was talking about the girl I was with. And you out here with something that looked like that. I was like, you should see the other chicks I mess around with. <laughs> you followed me yesterday, you'd have been proud of me. Yo. I'm sorry you had to see her. Get away, you messing everything up for me. Fellas, you might want to get my number after the show. I found an abortion clinic with pool tables in it. <laughs> nah, he's crazy. Yeah. While, while my girl was in the recovery room, me and the doctor was gambling, I won all my money back. <laughs> I'm up 100 for the next time I go. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Hey, that was a joke, ladies. Don't. First of all, don't get mad at me because I don't believe in abortion clinics. I uh, take my ladies to Six Flags. <laughs> Put them on every roller coaster out there. Yeah. Yeah. My stomach hurts. <laughs> Time to go. <laughs> Nah, he's crazy. <laughs> yeah, that was we, a joke. Nah, Ladies, you I'm on your that side. Ass. Let me tell you something. I'm on your side for real. In fact, let me tell you something, fellas. I'm about to switch it up. <laughs> hey, if you really love your woman, I see a lot of y'all got your girl with you tonight. If you really love her, she should be able to check the voicemail on your cell phone <laughs> and your email. Go ahead, I don't got nothing to hide. <laughs> That's right, because if you're a real player, you got an email and a cell phone she don't even know about. <laughs> <laughs> I always get out the shower. Hey, answer that phone for me. My real phone buried out back in a potato chip wrapper. <laughs> nah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You should Yo. see some of the ladies, they like, <laughs> I don't like him. <laughs> or, am I the only one who does this program numbers in your phone, not by the name of the person, but by the name that makes you remember them? Yeah. Like Musty Dude, <laughs> B 
begging man. Who well, I gotta answer this is, is Swallow. <laughs> hey, baby, how you doing? It's good to talk to you. Um, I met, I met my 11-year-old son for the first time last week. <laughs> he had an attitude, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what makes this shit so funny is the fact that he's mad calm when he's doing it. He know he's saying some reckless shit, but he's mad calm when he's saying it. He was acting just like his mama. What you... <laughs> He was acting just like his mama. What you showing up now for? I don't know what. I'm like, hey, 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 hey. First of all, I had a show in town. Don't flatter yourself, little player. <laughs> now, um, what's your name? No. <laughs> Stop looking at your girl getting permission to laugh, fellas. <laughs> Shouldn't have brought her to the show if you didn't want to have a good time. I got this one chick I'm dating. She like to have sex with a lot of men. Yeah, she mess with a lot of men. I know it. And she got a little son, too. I like him. He real cool. You know, I mean, hey, little man, he like five years old, so... Since his mom mess around with a lot of guys, I figured I'd help him up. I helped him uh, set up a lemonade stand right in front of her door. Uh, I went over there the other day. He was like, man, I'd have made 1500 in two weeks. <laughs> they come out of there thirsty as hell, man. <laughs> Let me get four of them, little man. Let me... All you guys out there who are amateurs in the dating game, tonight if you with a girl you don't know that good, don't leave her in your car unattended. There are things in your glove compartment with your real name on it. When I'm out with a girl I don't know, I'll be like, hey, look here, I'm about to go out here and pump the gas. I'm gonna need you to go out there and do the windshield for me. <laughs> It ain't a request, you know what I mean? It's not a request. And women, y'all, y'all have me laughing. Oh my God, y'all think y'all put us on punishment when we drop you off at the house? It's so funny. Here they go. None for you tonight. Not from you. None from you tonight. <laughs> I just got to drive across town. Hey, I'm Corey Oakley. Y'all be cool. Peace out. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. And that shit ain't a lie either, bro. Cause that's one thing that I hate, bro. I hate when I hate when females try to act like they're the prize. Like, no, like we have something to offer too. Like, okay, you got a coochie and like what does that mean? I can either get it from you, get it from somebody else, and I have shit to offer too, so stop trying to act like you're the main one. Like stop please but yo that was Corey hokum stand-up comedy i don't know what it was called there's no name so if anybody knows comment down below and then i'll change the title but i really enjoyed that video it was my first time watching him that was funny if y'all want me to watch more videos just comment any that you have down below and i'll get to it as soon as possible if this is your first time here and you want to be part of the clock gang make sure you smash that like button hit that subscribe button turn on post notifications but with that man, it's your boy Zinte. It's been a realist hour. And until next time, GG's. Fits on that lunchroom table sound like a beatbox. Know a couple niggas that used to carry that heat rock. But I ain't take that path because that's not my lifestyle. No, nope. used to carry some protection on me. That's a lifestyle. My name is Mike Zen, and I feel like the chosen one. Me and you, King James, nigga, you not the only one. King. Trying to get to that top spot like LeBron James. In your daughter crib, butt naked like I'm Ving Rain. Working hard every day to get that Bill Gates money. I be hearing little shit like, damn, now he moving funny.